Hello friends, welcome to Technique. This is Normal here, and in this video, we're gonna do a speed test comparison of two mid-range smartphones below the twenty thousand price segment. We have the Moto One Fusion Plus, and we also have the Redmi Note Eight Pro. So the Redmi Note 8 Pro was announced last year, and this device comes with the Helio G90T processor, which is one of the really powerful gaming-centric smartphones. Now we have the uh, Qualcomm's Snapdragon 730G on the Moto One Fusion Plus, and both the devices have six gigs of RAM. So we'll just go to the settings uh, of these two devices. So about phone, and uh, let's see here. So we can see that uh, both the devices have Android 10 as well. In fact, uh, the Redmi Note 8 Pro, which we have, has been updated to Android 10. We have done a video. Now it's uh, it has not been ruled out OTAs, but we have the Android 10 on this device. You can see here. And this is the MIUI 11 version. While uh, we have uh, uh, the Android 10, and uh, this uh, has uh, the 6 gigs of RAM and 128 gigs of storage variant. So we'll just go here uh, to the hardware information. So you can see here uh, 128 gigabyte uh, storage and 6 gigs of RAM. So both the devices are uh, having uh, the 6 gigs of RAM, and uh, both are running on Android 10 as well. So we'll just clear off all the apps uh, from the background. And uh, we'll uh, so there you go. You can see that now we have cleared off all the apps from the background. Now you can also see that we are connected both the devices to the same Wi-Fi network, and both are right now in airplane mode. Now next uh, we are going to uh, start the test. So we'll open these 16 apps, and then we'll uh, uh, show you how good the performance is. We'll also test the memory management. So before starting, once again uh, you can see that uh, there are no apps running in the background. So let's get started with uh, PUBG Mobile. So we have enabled the gaming mode on both the phones. So both are uh, using the gaming uh, options uh, while opening of games. So you can see that uh, Redmi Note 8 Pro has taken a lead. But in fact, uh, the PUBG Mobile was loaded faster on the Moto uh, One Fusion Plus. That's quite surprising. Uh, even though it's a gaming-centric smartphone, uh, it was loading faster on the Moto One Fusion Plus. Now next is uh, Temple Run. So let's see which opens Temple Run faster. So you could see the exact same time. Uh, so there is no clear winner here. Next uh, is uh, Play Store. So here we see Redmi was faster. Now Google Chrome browser. So here Moto was faster. Redmi is taking a lot of time. Now Facebook. Again, exact same time. Now Twitter. Here, Redmi was faster. Instagram. Again, Redmi uh, was faster. Ghana. Exact same time. Amazon. Here, Moto was faster. Flipkart. Again, uh, Moto is faster. Now, File Manager. Here again, Moto is faster. Settings, almost same time. Probably the Redmi had an edge. Now YouTube, exact same time. Gmail, again a fraction of a second. It was faster on the Redmi. Camera application, again Moto was a tad faster. Now Maps, Moto was faster. So what you could see here is that. Both are having their own advantages because uh, the Helio G90T is really good uh, chipset. But uh, you could see that uh, Moto had the advantage here. More of uh, apps were faster on the Moto uh, One Fusion Plus, while uh, only a few were faster on the Redmi Note 8 Pro. But having said that, the Redmi Note 8 Pro is almost eight uh, uh, to ten months old device. So that has to also be should be taken care because it's not a brand new device. Over a period of time, updates do slow down the OS. So that also has to be taken here. Now next uh, we'll uh, do the reverse test, the memory management test. So we'll open these 16 apps uh, in the reverse order. So let's see which is able to retain these apps. So maps, both have retained. Camera, both have retained. Gmail, again both have retained. YouTube, again they have retained. Settings panel, again they are retained. File manager is retained. Next is uh, Flipkart, again they are retained. Amazon, uh, they are retained. Ghana, again uh, they are retained. Instagram, they are retained. Twitter, they are retained. Facebook uh, is retained. 
Chrome browser is again retained. Play Store is also retained. Now only the games. Let's see which is able to retain the games. Now uh, Redmi Note 8 Pro has retained the game. That's quite surprising because in our last attempt, uh, uh, the games were not really that uh, good uh, in terms of uh, opening and also memory management. Here uh, Redmi has retained the game. The Redmi Note 8 Pro has retained the game. Now final game is PUBG Mobile. Let's see if uh, both have retained it. Now you could see that the Redmi Note 8 Pro has retained uh, PUBG Mobile. That's quite surprising. While uh, the Moto uh, One Fusion Plus has uh, reloaded the game. So uh, except for the games, all the apps were available on both the devices. But in terms of memory management in this test, the Redmi Note uh, 8 Pro definitely has an advantage. So here you could see that uh, while in terms of the app opening, uh, Moto One Fusion Plus has the advantage. While in terms of memory management, uh, Redmi Note 8 Pro has the advantage. So that is the speed test comparison. Hope you enjoyed watching this video. Do hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button for more videos. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.